Hi everyone, I'm here to show you all what a student sees on their Global Society member dashboard depending on the stage that they are in. So here you can see the member dashboard of a pre-travel student. You'll notice that the dashboards do have similar buttons, specifically all members do have access to the same community benefits and pre-travel and currently abroad students have access to the same resource benefits. As you can see at the top of the travel column, our pre-departure or our pre-travel students have access to the pre-departure pack. Uh, this has this is a digital pack and it has some resources such as a guide to exchange, an emergency information card, and some helpful packing tips. As a member of the Global Society, students also have access to tons of great benefits through STA. Uh, so one of these benefits is the flight layby option. This kind of deal allows them to lock in a flight for $99 early on so they can get the best price possible and the final payment is then due 10 weeks before the flight. The great thing about this option is that the $99 is refundable if the student has an issue with their visa, receiving OS help, or getting their acceptance letter from the host university. Pre-travel students also have access to the STA Win Your Flight for Free competition, um, discounted travel sims, and an international student identity card, both a hard copy and a virtual copy. You will notice that when I switch to our currently abroad member dashboard, that the resource buttons, as I mentioned, are the same as pre-travel. In our currently abroad dash student dashboard here, um, you can see that, as I mentioned, the community benefits are the same. Some of the travel benefits are a bit different for our currently abroad members. You will see that they have access to the virtual ISIC uh, card, so that's because international student identity cards do not ship internationally, ironically. Uh, so they do have access to the virtual card which has all the same benefits. Um, students you will notice currently abroad students don't have access to the pre-departure pack however they can still access all the same resources via the resource library here. Um, you can also see that currently abroad students have access to some STA travel discounts. This does include the flight layby option that pre-travel students receive as well as a lot of other discounts on things like insurance, accommodation, and other sort of travel tours. Here you can see our professional member dashboard. Uh, for this dashboard, you'll notice that the um, community resources are the same as our other two member types, and that the uh, resource benefits are slightly different. Professional members are eligible for an international youth card, as you can see here, which is slightly different from the international uh, student card, but you do get a lot of the same benefits and discounts. Um, it's just sort of a slightly different name. Our professional students also have access to the STA travel discounts such as flight layby as well as all those other discounts on things like insurance accommodation and adventure tours. Our professional members, as I mentioned, have slightly different resource benefits. Uh, you can see here the re-entry guide. So this gives them a lot of uh, tips and tricks and things they need to do upon uh, returning to Australia after their exchange. There's also some information here on saving their memories and kind of why it's important and how they can do that and then some what they can do next. So what sort of programs or exchange um, or study tours things can they do once they have completed their uh, first overseas study. If students have any questions about their dashboard or benefits, just have them contact us at info at globalsociety.com.au. Also make sure to check out some of those template responses that we've created for you down the bottom of this page. Feel free to copy and paste those as you see fit. Um, you can reward them as well. Thanks.